further forward, Jordan Murray gets the reward for netting a consolation against Obseth is his replacement, while Ryan Kitto drops down to the bench. And Kurt Ams, our referee, gets us underway with a blast on the whistle. It's the Marinade. The brighter start of the two, Miliusnic breaking the challenge of Stensness and firing in the first effort. Galafoko and it's Samuel Silvera into the box, challenged by Moroni. Kurt Ams says penalty. And there are a few complaints by the Adelaide defenders, Michael Love. Big chance for the Mariners, this. And Mila Juric fires it past his own. And the Central Coast, with their first effort on goal after a rather shaky start, have the early lead through the serve. Well, even though Izzo goes the right way, there's no stopping this penalty. Opposite number, Herchan Verbeek. There's no uh, particular response. A most really good play by the centre forward, clipped in by Orr. Silvera, and then a snapshot from Juric looking for his second. And it almost worked out all right, that for the Mariners. Milan Juric in the end. Oh, that's lovely. Absolutely sensational by Clisby. It's too high for Murray. And evades Silvera. It was a tempting cross, though, by kick completely. James Troisi he didn't. The rebound might favour McGree here. Ruan Tongi gets it clear. And a really good chance for James Troisi. Billy Usnich is quick. Tongik is strong. He almost squeezed through, didn't he? And in the end, Birigiti grateful to grab hold of the ball at the start. Still going. Halloran, McGree. Looks good this for the Reds. Halloran! 1-1. One, one. And that was wonderfully worked by the Reds. And fired in with real pace and power by Ben Halloran to square up the ledger. Well, what a great move and brilliant play from the left fullback. Now without a clean sheet and counting. Bring Even though he's a, the plays the right way, there's no here. stopping this penalty. He should, maybe he shouldn't have done that. Rivera and Tommy all looking at that back post area. Was it over the line? Michael Jakobsen heads it clear. And Jordan Murray didn't uh, appear. Goes away from Jordan Murray with ease. And the cutback is excellent. Yeah. Oh, that's a splendid goal. Nikola Miliusnic on the volley, top corner. Paul Izzo, no chance. And Adelaide are in front after falling behind on six minutes. Oh, what a finish. Absolutely brilliant finish, how he readjusts his body. And a volley with the inside of the foot. His second of the season. Snitch. Maria's continued the run. Maybe fancies getting in on the action himself. It's Riley McGree with the final effort. Oh, it's really good play. Pace burns off Clisby and gets there ahead of Fox. Opseth in the middle, it's three. Beautifully worked again. And the Norwegian has his first A-League goal. And that could be a hammer blow just before the break to the Mariners. 3-1 Adelaide. Well, they just stopped. And Halloran, the pace. The ball from Troisi. Gets a return from Silvera. A drive for goal, and Izzo forced into action to push it over the top for another corner. And that will do for a first half that has produced four goals. The opening one of them this season in 15-16. At the break, it's the Mariners 1. The Reds three. They were undermanned, driven in the free kick by Riley McGree, and it evades everybody. Jakobsen has screamed for him well at times. Is offset. Sitting away from his defender and found the angle for the shot. Oh, and McGree, yes, penalty. The challenge by Galafoco from behind. The second time he's conceded a penalty in two home. Oh, it's saved by Birigiti. Stuck out a leg, he went centrally. A big Norwegian. Mariners looking to make the most of their lifeline. And it's Galafoco! Well, that would have been redemption, wouldn't it? But for a good save. All good movement again. And the rebound falls. Halloran's way tries to dink it over the top of Birigiti. Impudent before Clisby scoops it away. Just needed that. Mariners. And ben Halloran stolen on the blind side. Goes for goal himself. And he finds the side netting. Well, they certainly didn't track the runner. Completely free. And Still time for him to get a goal, perhaps. And he forces Paul Izzo into a save, or rather... Oh, trying to turn things around. Meantime, McGree has got a bit of room here, and it's fired over by Miliusnic, who, by right, probably could have had a hat-trick or even more today. And again, you look at that, and they get him behind again. Towards Matt Simon, it might drop here for Juric. Across the face, and it's swept away. Kim Onsun on the volley, but uh, it's too far in front of Matt Simon and the chance is gone.